I wonder what Mr. Lee might know about this mask. And that's that. Every crime tower in the city is now repaired. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close, but between Spider Cop's reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites, like peanut butter and chocolate, or breakfast for dinner. The two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Yeah, definitely. caller who thinks we're better off thanks to Spider. Let's see if I can set her straight. You're on with J. Jonah Jacobs. I just want to say that I've never seen Manhattan so safe and peaceful. Compare what it was like when Spider-Man first showed up to now. Okay, fair enough. I will. Then, we had police and firefighters doing a wonderful job. Bear with me. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Should have heard about that job by now. You guys holding up all right? This moron thinks I'm going to move in with my daughter. Hey, that'd be great. She hasn't asked, but she's not gonna. I'm not going anywhere. You don't know that. Nobody does. Well, I'm not going anywhere. That's a promise. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. 
Where does she find it? Uh, I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. I've never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Spider plushie! Oh, a toy designer made this prototype to get me to license my likeness. Too bad there's no way to get paid without revealing my identity. Looks like we've got some doorbusters. It's not even Black Friday. Shut up, you're right. Ever hear a knocking? Don't you guys watch horror movies? Splitting up is always a bad idea. Peter, Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry, I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I, I didn't forget, forget, I just, uh, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker, you're better than this. 
<sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? guys have an impressive social circle. Glad I stopped that. Too many crazy drivers in the city as it is. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... 
but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. I should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Harry left me a message about these before he left for you. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is too. It's not gonna pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, oh, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. For 
these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha. I'm getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff, anyway. <coughs> Got it. Freaking these people out. Now what else is new? Huh. The toxins coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Great light on that one. Smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Can I get an autograph? 1072. Reports of on suspects mugging civilians. Incident is active near Long Acre. Over. Muggers, gotta jump in. Oh, you started without me. Peter, I'm just looking for the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. Demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even like mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense to his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Quit moving!
businesses by not robbing them, please! Good old-fashioned hold-up. Vintage crime stopping right there. I'll text Yuri the location. The cops will be here. Hey! Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa! Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Yeah! Man, can't wait to put you back behind yeah! bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid? You just stupid! You talk so much! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of oh, okay. Now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me! anymore you're lucky you found actual cash if you really want to rob banks try day trading it's all the rage wait wait wait, wait. Oh, no. oh come on herman you tell me who you're working for i can help you cut a deal if i caught i'm dead they made that very clear Sorry, Herman. 
this on yourself. Literally. He was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on Demon, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. I shouldn't have asked. Fight with Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. Doc left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture gets up, my life's over. Give me the plans and it won't. Got it. Very nice. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I leak the photo. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist. But I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Another 
victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No purchase with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. I need a better angle. There's a weak spot. It's promising. So I looked in the reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. Sorry. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture gets out, my life's over. Bad angle. Give Need to get it straight on. Very nice. Perfect shot. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I leak your photo. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the Black Maver and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What are they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Another victim? Or an accomplice? I need a photo. No purchase with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Catch my train. I want to keep the boss away. That's gonna be our biggest score yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've got to follow him. He'll spot me in the subway. Need to track him from up here. Where is he getting off? Uh, tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path.
Harmon. The blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of heist movies. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. Head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. He's heading for that office building. ready and we are running late. Let's roll. They're on the move. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. I love it when a plan falls apart. Hey, Carmen. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night that Sean committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man. Sorry, Yuri. You were saying something about the demons? They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. This article blaming Spider-Man for electro-killing cops was the last straw. 
I had to quit taking pictures that helped Jameson print lies about me. idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working on this case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. into running jobs for the demons. These guys are serious. Do they just want to replace Fisk? That'd be bad enough. Hope it's not something worse. out bullies you were just in time they were like animals Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check. Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. A lot of junk scattered around here. A local's web shot could make a great distraction. That sniper has a guard watching him. May need to divide and conquer. Now let me focus. Now they keep talking about gear. What does Fisk store here? To finish the survey yet? Still working. These maps are as complicated as they are old. Like studying hieroglyphs. We'll start translating. I want this wrapped up so we can secure the last of the gear in the vault. Yes, sir. On it. I heard that. Did I imagine that? Hopkins, check in. Someone find Hopkins. Better not have his radio turned off again. Roger. 
I'll check it out. Got webs here! Heads up for Spider-Man! Get me some backup! it off. Literally didn't see that coming. Who's there? Hey, I need a hand. I'm here. Let's go. You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Should be conduits leading to it. Yeah, got it. Did we 
charging overloaded, that should force the door open. I've been working on electric webbing. This is the perfect field test. Sit tight. Electric web for the win. The gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. I started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. Did that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. Thanks. No way I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. We got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room, there could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Aha. Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. Now that I know I'm after scrapes, I should take another look around. Dirt. Scrape, no door. None I can see anyway. Great. Be right there. Maybe not. Elevator's busted. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. I could use a little help with the elevator. Right, I'm on it. Second floor, rusted machine parts, big honking rats. <laughs> Careful, the bridge is out. I got this one. Nice, stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. You were after Fisk for a long time. He's my great white whale. <laughs> Found one. Nailed it! Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. But look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. If I were a junction box, where would I be? Follow the conduits. They should lead you in the right direction.
Can't be that many places to hide a junction box. Right, Jeff. Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. I'm blocked. Anything you can do? What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. Place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. Sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Come on, let's go! Damn. Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. There. They blew the locks to get in. Shh. Demons. Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. They're moving. Let's go. Get them! Find cover! That's what I'm talking about! Come <laughs> on. 
you okay? Go! I'll get you up! I lose two trucks full of gunmen in one day. It's time to hang up the web. Sanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Here's hey guys, room for one more. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Hop in. She's good. Man, 
I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Come on. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage. Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30 ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure. I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great. I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, wait. I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. Should be some trucks close by. Nope. Stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. <laughs> There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh, looks like trouble. Help! 
Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. I think that's it. Please be here, please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Look, is that guy Spider Man? Uh oh. Ice! Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. All right, how am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over? Oh, that's too good. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Oh, okay, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? Cool window, but I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place. Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Huh. Someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked, though. Hey there, Spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. Black Cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do.
Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were going to meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. You might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong. Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people, and it's ruining New York. I believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. What are you doing here so late? Hope May's couch is comfortable. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after... Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Want to join me? Yeah, of course. See you then.
so humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward.